All right, friends. Well, I'm having a couple of computer difficulties, but here we are. We're going to see if we can uh, drive on. So now I have successfully gotten guys on all the way on the other side <clears throat> and a couple of the guys on the inside. So we're going to go ahead and move around to the back. So I do have, again, I do have a system that kind of helps me clear this area pretty well. I kind of know where everybody are, where they are and where, uh, where I can get crushed and where I can, okay. A little bit of lag there. All right, you want to make sure that that dog and that guard are not looking. Wait for them to get away. All right, let's see, little doggy there, and the guard. All right, now you don't want to run right on out. Let's just wait a second, kind of watch. Let them get past that wagon wheel a little bit. I need another minute, and there's going to Let's see if I can get him with the big smackola. All right, now I'm going to zip. All right, they didn't see me. Good, but they are coming back. So, I'm going to, you got a choice with these. You can kill the dog first, or you can kill the dude first. My weapon isn't good enough to one-shot the dude. So I think I'm going to have to get the dog. He's confused. Weird. Like that. This guy is not confused. Hopefully I don't run into some bats out here. Let's see if he comes and follows me. I'm just going to go back over here and hide a little bit, see if he'll leave me alone. Nope. He's coming for me. Alright, this may be my first death right here. Let's see if I can... Here we go. And... Bop! Bop! Alright, got lucky on that. Might be able to get him with a jumping attack here. That worked out pretty well. So guys, you gotta master these timing things. That's This whole game is about <laughs> being in the right place at the right time and ducking, dodging, and moving. Now you can do some blocking. You know, you got this cool block move and you, you got a shield. You can do that even better. It's way better with a shield. Alright, let's see if he comes. <clears throat> Watching. So they give you some indications, right? They draw the weapon, shoot the weapon. Remember, I killed his dog, so I can get him now. Wait till he turns around, I'm gonna get him with a backstab. Or should I say a kidney pounding? Freaking hammer his kidneys. All right, I'm getting pretty bold with this move, but on occasion, I get I make mistakes. I'm getting pretty good at him now. Get more beast bones from the doggy. Alright, again, let's get this dog first. Ooh, I knocked him silly and I was able to get an extra hit off of him. That was sweet. Not bad. Alright. So if my calculations are correct, there's only one guy left. That's the captain of the guard. I'm going to go ahead and heal. And I'm not going to fight him quite yet. Let me think. I'm going to run and go do something super quick. So once you tap this other area over here, You should get 
hopefully I haven't jacked myself up. I had some computer problems earlier, so I ended up having to not save, and I lost some data. Let's see if uh, this gives it to me. Talk to Melina. Me? I'm searching for my purpose. For the reason there is something I've acted, the thing I am knowing. Okay. Shall I turn you let my hand share them with me? I can level up. Your thoughts. I'm gonna do vigor oh, again. Let me get that up to about 20, by the way. Alright. So, that's pretty good. I'm going to do a quick teleport back to... Fast travel back to the church. Talk to this other witch. <clears throat> I think I lost that data. And she's going to give me a spirit that I can summon. And that is crazy helpful. Or maybe I've lost it. Dang, please tell me I haven't lost it. Maybe it's in here. There it is. I already got it. All right, that's what I was waiting for. Pretty cool. I did not need to make that trap travel all the way back. Okay. So anyway, by restarting, by clicking that that point, because I I thought I I forgot that I. I just didn't think I had that spirit. I needed that spirit to fight that boss. I guess I have to go ahead and re-clear everything. <clears throat> That's okay. I'll tell you what I'm going to do. Um, yeah, let's see this one more time here. Oops. I blew that one. I don't want to say that I'm a perfectionist, but I seriously like doing things a certain way, and man, he got a scrap with him <clears throat> instead of sticking to the plan. It's just harder. I'm dead. Uh, something weird happened then. Alright, I'll fight this one guy here. Predictable. I got two. Nice. Take the swing. So then get this guy. He's got a heavier swing, so he's slower. Yeah. <clears throat> Not bad. <sighs> well, this time through has been sloppy, but you know what? You gotta adapt and overcome a little bit, right? I forgot that there's a thing over here. Let's get this. Rune fragment. Got it. You can change those into something. Yeah, they're from crafting. Blast him. In the back. In the head. Let's see if he gets up. And bop. What? I tried to roll and it didn't let me. Man. Not good. There are ways that you can get more of these potions, because that's the only way you can heal if you're not a faith-based character. The faith-based character have a heal spell, which is really stinking handy. Um, I think there's also some life drain. Uh, I gotta wait. Anyways. You can get more potions, and you can get the efficiency of these potions can increase. So you have to go to these different places. Um, ironically, there are ruins, different churches that you go to, and you get these different um, upgrades for your stuff. All right, remember, let's let him get past that. Oh, I did not mean to do that. I hit him with the freaking heavy button first. It worked, but that is not what I meant to do. <clears throat> Here comes the dog. It's actually a wolf, I think. 
It's a big dog gun. Alright, so I made a mistake. I clicked the button way too many times. And when you do that, you get this ammunition, o or not ammo, this automation or animation overload. Alright, let's lock on the right guy. Take your swing. Oh, he almost got me with this second shot. That's always bad. Let's get this guy. I do not fear the guys without the shields. It's the spearmen that are kind of sucky. Come on, dude. What you gonna do? What you gonna do? Look how fast I am. Oh, yeah. That's not the attack I want you to do. There it is. Big wind up and a miss. So again, if you pick up the timing, that is how you fight. Or at least that's how I fight, I should say. Again, you can block, and I'm going to get a shield at some point, I'm going to block. All right, let's see what I got. I think I got a sword. Sweet! So I can one-hand this sword, and it does pretty much the same damage, but I like the two-hand. Until I get a uh, shield. Now I can one-shot people easier with my... Uh, Backstab. I find this weapon to be more better. All right, let's zip down here in this little cave. This area is safe, so you can just wander down. If you don't know if the area is safe, you should probably creep. All right, let's open this up. Ah, I got the whetstone knife that helps me to um, improve my armaments. I got Storm Stomp. Sweet! Alright. These in some ways just make your weapons better, but in other ways gives you kind of an extra little special ability. Alright. Wasn't really ready for this guy. Let's go ahead and fight him. Now here's how I like to fight this guy. I make some space. I hear he's right behind me. I click this button and I get my spirits, spirit wolves to help me out. And then I just let them knock him off balance. Ooh, I'm about dead. Got cocky. Let's let the dogs get back onto him. Hang it! I thought it was out of range. So you see how the dogs helped me? Because <clears throat> otherwise that guy's taking it tough. Alright. Now, you will get a notification. By the way, let's get on the horse. I do not have that equipped either. Man. Let's try this again. Get on the horse. And we'll go ahead and finish clearing everything else out. So you guys might notice I've done some work. My cavalry skills are halfway decent. Missed some other people apparently. Got the dogs, I got all those guys. Oh, I see. I missed these guys over here. So, anyways, while the dogs are with me, let's just go ahead and uh, go back to the basics here. 
Let's smack this guy. Now, a little bit different animation. Swoop! That's pretty cool. And he's dead dead. And we'll let the dogs hit him a couple times. And then I'll finish him off. So, I started playing this game and I did not know how to use the dogs. I didn't know how to summon the spirits. And it just sucked. It sucked so bad. It was so hard. Um, but you know, you, you're, you get good at your, you know, your other combat skills. Center punch this guy. Kokunyo! Alright, now it says vanquishing the enemy group. When you're done, you get this cool little glow, which tells you everybody dead. And it gives you like some of your potions back. That's pretty stinking handy. So you get back on here and you rinse and repeat until you are, you know, as leveled up as you want to be. Then, you know, you go and you do some other stuff. I'm going to, I got 30 seconds left. I'm going to go ahead and take a pause and I'm going to show you guys where to go next. We're going to get another potion. And I can level up and guess what? Ooh, I leveled up twice. More of the vitality, I promise you guys. You won't, you won't regret that. All right. <clears throat> We're going to pause right here. Maybe in a minute I'll get a shirt. <laughs> that would be pretty cool.